All right, I uh, I made a different kind of windmill. Uh, the the vertical axis turbine is moving in very low winds. This other one doesn't really move. The hot, uh, but sometimes it starts to move. Uh, the better, the better one I believe for me to do right now is actually concentrate on the vault and uh, make them make it bigger, taller, and a little bit uh, wider to catch all the little winds that I have here. See, it's starting to move now. But it's just, this is my normal wind that I have here. There it goes. But, um, yeah, I could add more blades, but it's still, it's not going to start off as easy as the, the Vaught. Um, you know, any, uh, I know I could pick up a little bit more speed than the, uh, the Vaught, but still I still gotta figure out um, I need to know also where's a, a good set of magnets that I could actually get and what the wires I need to actually get to do because I was thinking about using 30 gauge wire to actually um, make all my windings and I was gonna try to use a uh, the disc was going to be maybe 32 inches where the magnets would be from the center of the magnets and the wires I was going to try to just use 30 inch I mean 30 gauge wire but I don't know some other people might say oh that's too small it'll give me a lot of voltage but no amperage but if I have a lot of them can't I parallel them together and have a whole bunch of series and then parallel a few to bring up the amperage. All right, uh, give me your suggestions, all right? Thank you for all the other ones from before, all right? Bye.